You need to watch this if you want to know more about how the Bunker Buster bombs work. These beasts aren't your average explosives. Here's the story behind the bombs that changed the battlefield. Bunker Busters are the military's answer to fortified underground targets. Think command bunkers, missile silos, and hidden weapons caches. Their secret? Insane engineering. These bombs are built with super-hardened steel casings and shaped for maximum aerodynamic speed so they don't just explode, they obliterate whatever's hiding beneath layers of concrete and earth. Rewind to World War II. The British dropped monsters like the Tall Boy and Grand Slam, massive aerodynamic bombs weighing up to 10 tons. Dropped from over 20,000 feet, they could go supersonic, spinning for stability, and punch right through 15 feet of reinforced concrete. Fast forward, America took the concept further. In the Korean War they introduced the Tarzan with remote guidance. During Operation Desert Storm, the famous GBU-28 was built in just 28 days, using artillery barrels as bomb casings. Today's bunker busters, like the US Blue 109 or Russia's KB-1500 LPR, are laser-guided, can weigh over 3,000 pounds, and can smash through meters of rock or concrete before detonating. Most recent times, B-2 Spirit Bombers used massive GBU-57 Bunker Buster Bombs in a strike against Iran's nuclear facilities in Fordo, proving these bombs are still shaping warfare. From Wutu Giants to today's high-tech precision weapons, Bunker Busters have one mission, nothing stays safe underground. Thanks for tuning in, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this.